Good morning, Major. We have little time to waste. The big push I warned you about is on, and the order's time on Creek 7B is nearly up. You have proven to be an effective commander, and I am moving you out to head our northern polar assault group. If I push into the snowy wastes, it'll take at least a day just to frostproof our equipment. You have four hours. As to the why of things, well, as you know, the recent victory by the CSS Astrid has given us air superiority. Recon flights have since located all of the order assets, protecting the remaining Xenofax sites. All except the northern sites, where our scanners cannot seem to get a reading on anything at all. A jamming field? Exactly. None of the other order bases are large enough to serve as a global command post, so we can only assume the bulk of their forces remaining on Krig are under that jamming field. Your job will be to drop in around the point where the field is the strongest and then to find its source. You'll have three dropships at your disposal, so you will be landing in force. In force, but without a clue as to what's waiting for us. Craven soldiers are trained to be adaptable, Major. I suggest you take advantage of that training. You are dismissed. Hello everyone, and welcome to Ground Control. Now we are approaching the end of the Craven campaign, but there are still uh, three very cool missions left, and those are the winter missions. Or snow missions, I guess. Um, at the North Pole, there is um, pretty much always winter. Not really, of course, but might as well. I think I want all heavy pterodines for this mission. Yes. Also, rocket pterodynes, of course, which will make anti air pterodynes obsolete. Artillery, yes, yes. And bombers. Now, those guys are amazing, and you will see why. New drop zone. There are two drop zones available Dropship here. Entering atmosphere. Dropship entering atmosphere. Dropship entering atmosphere. But I much prefer this uh, northern one because that road to the enemy base is um, easier. Mission update. The center of the interference field is marked on the tactical map. The jamming facility must be near there and it will be heavily defended. Now, the reason why Bomber Aerodines are awesome, <laughs> you will see. Enemy attacking squad five. Enemy destroyed. Hmm. I was actually expecting some uh, resistance around here. Maybe that's still to come. Oh well. Ah yes, there they are. Five recharging. Ah, they will not hit. Squad five recharging. But now, just watch. Ah. Yes. Yes, they are that powerful. So they can uh, absolutely wreck everything that is on the ground, however they are 
incapable of attacking other planes and are very vulnerable to missiles or really any kind of anti-air um, weapons. So you always have to use them with care. Yeah, this is a very basic uh, attack mission. There's this enemy base here, we have to destroy it. No complicated stuff. It's just that uh, getting there will take some time because my army is very slow. Just a lot of very heavy uh, vehicles. Obviously those bomber aerodynes are also um, uh, vulnerable uh, against uh, other aerodynes, so I'll keep those fighters close. Like for this case. And I cannot send my aerodynes anywhere near the base. Roger Way too many defenses there. Ah, some Templars, they are no more. Ah, damn it. They are attacking my uh, snipers. Enemy attacking squad 12. Unit lost, squad 12. On our way, Major. Enemy aerodyne destroyed. Commencing bomb run. Coordinates received. We are on our way. Yeah, so far no problem at all. Enemy aerodyne destroyed. Now I know there is a missile launcher right here, I think. Yes, should be there. I'll have my uh, snipers deal with that. Enemy 
attacking squad six. Enemy aerodyne destroyed. Yes, Major. Attacking. Enemy aerodyne destroyed. No problem. Moving out, Major. Yeah, there it is. Major, we're moving out. Enemy attacking squad one. Enemy structure destroyed. Movement order received. Yeah. <laughs> Heavy hover dines and they are gone just like that. Beautiful. Squad six recharging. Coordinates acknowledged. Yeah, just keep moving. Squad six recharging. Right away, Major. Move order received, Major. Coordinates received. Yeah, I'm going. Enemy attacking squad two. Commencing bomb run. Yes, Major. Attacking. Enemy attacking squad 2. Enemy hover dying destroyed. Attack order received. Oh, so there's some more um, enemy infantry. Actually, no, that's too close. Get back. That's too close to the enemy base. Enemy infantry destroyed. Wrecked. Yeah, I'm going. Right away, Major. Right away, Major. Now this enemy base really is um, heavily defended. They have those tier seven Guana turrets or whatever they're called. A lot of missile launchers. A lot of defenders. Ah, but we can deal with it all, I think. Because I know this mission well, I have all the units I need. They won't be able to uh, stop me. Squad 4 taking friendly fire. Enemy infantry destroyed. Yeah. Not even Templars can harm those Enemy heavy terror dines. Excellent. That's how I like it. Major. Artillery moving out. Squad five recharging. Okay, so now Artillery, do your thing again. Clear the entrance for us. You guys, uh, yeah, have a look at this base for us. Yeah, I'm going right away, Major. Coordinates received. We are on our way. Artillery moving out. So, yeah, this is uh, the jamming facility. Now, actually, one good thing that the Order of the New Dawn has are those defender guns. Um, they will eliminate any incoming uh, projectile like a missile or an artillery grenade. So I cannot use my artillery to destroy this from out here. That simply won't work. So I will have to infiltrate the base. Not that it will be a problem. Enemy 
Haberdine destroyed. Enemy structure destroyed. Pulverizing target. Enemy structure destroyed. Beginning barrage. See? My uh, grenades are unable to hit this. Attack order received. Yeah, I'm going. Move order received, Major. Enemy structure destroyed. Pulverizing target. They won't be able to stop us. <laughs> this is a good example of what uh, a well composed army can do in this game because obviously there is a lot of resistance here, but uh, they are just not able to do anything ag against me because I have an answer for everything. Destroyed. If I tried to um, attack this with a massive force of only uh, tanks, then I probably would have uh, gotten utterly crushed. But like this, I know what is coming because of my uh, sharpshooters. If the enemy attacks with infantry, I use artillery. If they attack with aerodynes, I use the rockets. And if they attack with slow, heavy units, then I use my bombers. They can't win. Enemy Yeah, so now we have to destroy this completely. Nothing left standing. Now I should first destroy the enemy power supply. And the missile launchers won't work and I can move in with my bombers. <laughs> Look at that. Stop shooting the ground. Please. Area targeted for bombardment. Area targeted for bombardment. 
squad five recharging. Actually, um, you probably should guard this entrance. I don't want any surprises from behind. Squad five taking friendly fire. Ah, like this. Enemy See? Attacking squad five. Unit lost. Squad five. Ah, damn it. Station structure destroyed. Power station destroyed. All power supply terminated. Enemy automated defenses faulted. Enemy attacking squad five. Unit lost. Squad five. Enemy infantry destroyed. Enemy Major. structure destroyed. Enemy attacking squad five. Enemy aerodyne destroyed. Area targeted for bombardment. So now I will let my uh, aerodynes have some fun. Three, taking friendly fire. Enemy structure is destroyed. Preferably without killing my own troops. Order received. Enemy structure is destroyed. Yeah. <laughs> Beautifully done. Moving right away, Major. Mission update. Order base destroyed. Objective achieved. Recommendation. Immediately withdraw your forces to the marked pickup point. Yeah, so uh, that's it really. Let's get out of here now. Actually, the way back uh, won't take that long. I will just send my command APC ahead. Everybody else will follow, and the mission will end as soon as my APC uh, reaches the pickup point. Uh, but until then, let's actually uh, check this area too. This is the alternative uh, route to the base. If you use uh, the other drop zone. Enemy structure destroyed. So there are probably some enemies left around here somewhere. Attack order received. Commencing bomb run. Enemy structure destroyed. Squad 10 taking friendly fire. Unit lost. Squad 10. That um, happens sometimes, unfortunately. Yeah, friendly fire by uh, another bomber, that's pathetic, really. Now, I think that's all enemies killed. Yeah, there is nothing else to do. 
except to wait for for my APC to reach the pickup zone. This kind of backtracking, I have to admit, I think is pointless in this game. If there was any challenge um, to uh, reaching this, then it would be a different story, but it's just pure backtracking. Oh, but it will be over in a minute, so whatever. Excellent. I hate the snow. Reminds me of winter spent scavenging out in the Manchester ruins. At least there are no rats here. Once again, the Donnies have the advantage of knowing the terrain and weather. But there's a desperation to their tactics now. They have their backs against the wall. We were taking some Dawny prisoners out of the base wreckage, and one of them jumped on me and scratched at my armor with his bare fingers. My sergeant pulled him off while I just stood there staring at this crazy man sobbing his eyes out in the snow. All I could make out was that I'd robbed him of his birthright. I was somehow taking away his chance to speak to God. Maybe I'll go see if Peterson has used up his alcohol allocation for the week yet. So, yeah, that's it for this mission. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, see you guys next time. Take care.